Good afternoon, my name is Nakia Barber and I'm completing the EDS Instructional Technology Program at Kennesaw State University. I started the program in the spring of 2015 and at this time I am looking to be a technology coach in uh, middle and high school or elementary school settings. I've taught business and computer science for the past five years at middle school and high school. I'm currently teaching at Conyers Middle School, um, which is in Rockdale County. It's one of the four schools in the county. Prior to teaching at Rockdale, in Rockdale, I also taught in Savannah at Islands High School, where I taught Entrepreneurial Ventures, Computer Applications 1, and Computer Applications 2. This is my teaching experience, but I do have a lot of educational experience, which will make me a well-qualified candidate to be an instructional technology coach. I received my bachelor's degree at Valdosta State University in business education, and I'm a certified business ed teacher. I also have a master's degree from Walden University in integrating technology in the classroom. So with that, I wanted to get a specialist degree and I really love technology. Teaching business and computer science basically is teaching students how to integrate technology in the classroom. What we learn in those classes um, really ties a connection to what the students are learning in their content classes, but it's through the use of technology. A lot of the teachers that I know personally fear the use of t using technology. So I think that a great coach, a technology coach, helps a teacher understand the benefits of technology and how their classroom and their students can actually use technology to further learn and comprehend standards that are taught in their classroom. So this course has taught me several things using multimedia, not just the things that I've originally taught, but using um, Web 2.0 tools to get students involved in the classroom. I've learned how to create web quests. One of the biggest classes that I think will be um, very great for me is learning how to be a coach. Coaching teachers on how to use technology in the classroom. Also learning coaching styles, how teachers learn, co-teaching, being able to build a relationship with teachers in order to help them understand technology and what small things they can start doing in their classroom in order to help student learning. Student progress is really tied to how they learn and since we're in this 21st century technology world, great things happen when teachers learn how to allow their students to um, show what they've learned using technology. So the course itself and this program at Kennesaw State University um, has really taught me how to do research on different types of technology, how to stay up with current trends um, in technology, things that are great, things that aren't. And I'm able to do that by reading articles from other teachers that have tried to do these same things in their classroom. Um, there are so many articles online that will help teachers understand simple things that they can use in their classroom in order to allow students to grow. Technology, one-to-one -one devices, is going to help students be able to understand. They'll be able to use the internet for a resource. They'll be able to um, have blended learning in their classrooms. And these things will also help the teacher because the teacher then can learn to differentiate. You can assist ELL students. You can um, also work out the diversity of your kids and help them be able to process their learning. So some of the goals that um, I've gotten to at the end of this program will be continue my learning continue to go to workshops that would be a short-term goal we'll continue to learn um, go to workshops a long-term goal would be to continue um, understanding technology learning about new technology that is coming out um, looking at pilot models of other schools that have um, created different things online so that teachers can see these these projects and want to include more technology in their classrooms.